two last types I want to show how to break out a high resolution detail or low resolution mesh sheets are voxelization and beveling. So this is gonna be our object that we are gonna break out. As you can see, we can't really bevel these objects because there isn't really any good topology here. But these rails we actually can. So with one break we can combine two methods. So let's start with auto UV. So I put this already down. After that, let's explode the mesh. This should be fine. Now let's split. So we want to split into two parts. So <coughs> let's pick out this detail. Now the first part you want to voxelize the big part. So let's take a look at it. This preset is gonna work fine for me. We are getting nice beveling around the edges. And the other one we want to bevel. In Houdini 18 the beveling tool has been updated to make it a little bit more intuitive and user friendly so let's start with the distance i want to make it maybe a two and of course you don't want these edges so we can exclude by flat edges so something like this don't go too far so as you can see actually this part is actually picked up so one of the things you can actually do is choose to pick the group press N, select every one of the edges and now select it again and we can actually just deselect edges that we do not want to bevel so this is just a, just a quick way to do it so we don't have to create the group above it and then select it just go around the mesh take a look at the, everything is this beveling this looks fine and we are getting this weird shading but we can put down normal node and use the by face area so it's gonna clean up all our weird shading on flat flat polygons so this looks fine maybe increase that tad bit more Okay, now we're getting a nice result. Okay, so these two, we want to now merge them. As you can see, after the merge, we have a normal attribute for our rail, but for voxel, it actually isn't a normal, so we can just put down normal load above this. Make it 100, just to make sure that there's no hard edges so make it to 180 so this is going to be our high resolution bake now let's put down the baker with fox light meshes I find myself getting more consistent results with the map baker which is not the mantra one so let's use that so put high in high explode it into low like that So let's break it out and it should take only like 5 seconds. Okay maybe 10. So now that we have baked it out let's go back to the right after auto UV. Let's add a quick material. So just take a look where it's shaved out. So it's in my desktop, go to normal, so desktop, it's going to be in render, so here it is, it looks weird, just flip it, so 
let's put down a tint so this is our big normal map 